But, um, boss, this is not just any robot. He killed five of ours within seconds. I don't care. Your task is to do as I order. Sheesh. Cell Pony's going violent over there. Um, anyway, every pony with that, we are back from where Fallout Equestria remains. Let's see what they, um, keep having to say. Then if I order you to kill yourself, you go and kill yourself. You must have cleaned the sector the three freaking days ago. Do you not understand what that means? Well, at least the fake is getting, getting a little bit of sass. Got it, boss. Uh, we'll do it right now. Go and get some grenades. Take what you need. An hour later, this robot must be not must not be there anymore. Sheesh! Can't they get rid of a simple itty bitty tiny robot? That's like the easiest thing you'll ever do. Still, what robot are we talking about? Oh, it's probably probably a radio or something. I mean, that counts as a robot, right? So, can we beat a tiny robot? Well, wait. Before we go through, we actually need a stealth buck. This way. Oh, that was close. I don't have teleportation right now. We're just gonna make this extremely hard and probably force me to fight these. For I fight these guys the intended way. What is back here? Okay, this isn't bad. Uh, how are we gonna even fight this? Usually in a stealthy run or when I'm playing pacifist, I try to just stealth out of it immediately by running through the left side or teleporting. But I don't have teleport and I don't have a stealthy build either, so we're gonna have to force our way through here. We got about 20 seconds. Come on, I need another shield! Alright. So I'm trying to get the blue pony. If I can aim at him just right. I missed. Get backwards a little bit. Got him. Um, damn, I should have brought, um, should have brought one of those other potions down here. Spell charge? Okay. He's not moving. He's not moving. Got him! Yes! I confused him a little bit, but woo! Usually this place gets me into a lot of trouble. How can I learn about the chosen one? Um, yeah. But I have to remember if we go for a one life playthrough... And I have to go through this is to bring a wizardry potion. That's a, a big learning thing for me right here. Day 21. Usual routine was inter interrupted by the arrival of Butch's gang. Oh, they found some pony and took her. The prisoner is silent, choking in tears, assuring us that she remembers nothing but does not crack. Oh, I guess these raiders aren't good at talking to ponies. That's a nice thing. Oh, oh my gosh, those guys are like immediately there. Hey there, friends! Awfully anxious and excited to see me. Oh boy. Why do you gotta be tiny and annoying? Is, is this what they couldn't kill? Why can't they kill these tiny rolly things? Is this what they were afraid of? Amateurs! Are, are you like wastelanders for two days or something? Maybe that explains a few things, huh? What's this way? How did they even get it through here, then? Not at all? This is a 10 millimeter submachine gun. That's not spectacular. What about in here? Is this more spectacular? Oh, no, lock type. I'm getting in here anyway. Oh, hard but Is this... Oh, oh this... I, I, I just know this is going to give me... Okay, what's this got? Authorization complete. Hey, I'm the Overmare. Um, yes, I'm the Overmare. This is the founder and vice president of Stable Tech. Scootaloo! Oh, I don't like the cutie mark crusaders in this universe. You've been selected for your loyalty and sense of duty to both your fellow ponies and to our company. Even though Stable Tech headquarters most likely lie in ruins. The uniqueness of your stable is that you may be the only research institution that will remain operational. After everything goes down. According to our calculations, the mutual mega spell attack between us and Zebras will be so strong that no control center can stand, except stables. Okay, so, uh, so, suppose this place was the... <sighs> the first, first mind save that we find does this to us! 
and I can't even read. Or finish my thoughts for that matter. Anyway, this was the only research facility of the stables they put out there. That's interesting to know. But the first save that we find in today is obviously gonna do me dirty. Also something for a one life uh, playthrough, do not even mess with any mine save because there is even a tiny chance that they will blow up. And anything that can blow up has a shot at one-shotting you. But, take a look at this. Survival, I've given myself a few points off screen for memory orbs that we gotten. I'm at 19% right now, so I'm taking 19% more damage. So, in other words, I probably would have died to the raid raider otherwise if I didn't have that. Alright, gotta get these guys. Do, do, do. Shocking news! Arrgh! Arrgh! Still shocking. But there's actually a boss in here, but we're not going to deal with that just yet. We're going to go this way. Oh, that's not even going to let me back. i got to go all the way to the other one now. Fine. I guess. Pony has to do what a pony has to do. Oh. Anyway, we are going to have to bring some serious equipment in this every pony. I'm not even... Not even kidding, every pony. Sometimes I like taking it light and be, be a little careless, but this time we need to be serious. Because we're severely underleveled. How severely underleveled? Let's take a look at it this way. Recommended level 15. My level is 11. I'm four levels under what we should be. And you know what I say to that? That's exactly my kind of tea. Or, um, cider or hot cocoa or whatever you like, every pony. But I think you get the idea. So. I really hope we have enough damage to pull this off. That is the one thing I'm afraid of, but I am going to try and follow through with it. Um, two wizardries? I have a po I can have potion of ev ah. I can have a potion of vivacity. That could be very very big. So we're buying a lot, and I mean a lot of healing equipment. Yeah, I might as well get all of these. Get a bunch of these. And some of this. So I gotta need Rage Dash Buck. Except. Wait. Oh yeah, we're about to be able to do that. But, we got a potion of vivacity. I wanna at least see how much a single potion will do. So take a look at our running speed, and now... I will use the potion of vivacity, which... Should make me a little bit faster. Yeah, a tiny bit. A tiny bit. A tiny bit for certain. Bye. Yeah, nothing important there, but we do want to have repaired armor. Now, the robot is going to be using a lot of explosives, but also a lot of laser weapons as his main weapon. So, our leather we um, armor should be okay-ish against the, the plasma and lasers, but we're going to get smoked by the explosives, so we need to dodge crazily good. Leather... Oh my gosh, this is this is about to be bre breaking down, now. Um, what is this repaired with? Um, it doesn't even say. Strength and leather, leather right? Huh? Tanned leather... I guess this is what we need to repair it a little. And... There we go. But I do want to have it repaired all the way. Don't want my armor to be breaking in battle. Sheath. That just chews. That just chews right through everything in our money bag, every pony. But we shall stand strong. We need all these resources to make it work, every pony. I, I think this is going to be big. The question is, what defensive spell is are we going to go after? I mean, if we slow down the robot, do we have a, a bigger shot at beating it? Because magical barriers are going to hold against him for a little bit, but not long enough to the point where he can like hide in front of them. So I think distortion field is actually the better choice. Um. Oh yeah, we need a food item. We need a food item. Holly Shine, do you have something that lets me destroy things? More damage. We can, there's no such thing as having too much damage right now. Hey there, mister. I have much to do. Oh, fine. 
I guess he, he he probably doesn't want to join us anyway because this is dangerous, every pony. But we gotta do this. Ready? Let's do it. Into or back into the core of the stable. Oh, and a putsy back here. Oh, I should have just used a runic return. I'll see you at the door of this boss. All right, made it. But I found there's actually something that I can't open. It's uh, unreal. Yep, I definitely don't think I'm going in there. All right, Harry Pony. What do you think? How's this gonna go? How many tries? Come on, I I just hope we can first try this. Dash. Rage, because damage is always a good thing. Wizardry. Our main weapon, without a single doubt, has to be the lightning bolt. Game. Game, let me select my spell. There we go. In we go. Alright. Immediately start. Let's see if... Our spell's gonna make a difference. He's a little slower. He's a little slower. I think we got a better window at attacking him this time. And they changed this background music. Oh. Let's see. Oh my. This way, this way, this way. Oh my. We are pounding him though. We are pounding him nicely. The slowness is definitely doing its job, every pony. I think we found our new strategy for when the One Life Challenge comes around it. Hanging around in a poison cloud isn't one of them. Alright. This way, this way. Just to stand here. Get close and just pound away at this guy. That's a quarter of herself down. Just keep going, Leaf. Just keep going. Alright, he's doing this again. We have to be afraid of this... This is all poison cloud. The, the fart gas, every pony. That's what that is. That is fart, fart gas put to the extreme. Alright, um, go over there. Oh wait, I don't I don't have teleport, everybody. I don't have teleport. We're just gonna try to spread it a little out then. Last time I did this battle, I did have teleportation on me. Come on, Leaf. He's a third of the way there. And look at the slowness. It's just giving us a little bit of a bigger breath that we might need to beat this. Not enough magical power. I should have plenty of magic potions. Hey, buddy! Hope you have enough breath to beat this! Alright, he's he's into his second form. I hope you have enough, enough to chew through this. There we go. Still able to chew through a little, I think. Wait, did, did we just find an exploit with this thing? I think we did find something. Come on, leave. Ah! Okay, we need to be afraid of this now. I think we have to start using the side a little bit more. Alright. Alright. Run across this. Use this top area. Ah! Not again. Okay. We should be able to be fine here. Hopefully. Ah! Oh my gosh, he just stopped. He just stopped then and there. Magic potion. Alright, now we have to start using the, the, the side areas. Okay, get up this way. Get up this way. Um, heal up a little bit. Okay, that's good enough. Keep up, Leaf. We don't do a lot of damage, but, but we can be persistent with him if we can keep slowing this thing down. Remember the potion of vivacity that we used? I think it's coming in big. Wait, we can just juke this guy? I didn't know about that until now. I forgot stamina's a thing in this game. Um, healing potion. Heal up all the way now. Magic potion. Why is this always the battle that gets the closest every pony? I don't know. Don't know why I did to this game. Okay. And down. Down, 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 down. We're going this way. Stamina! Stamina problems! Stamina! 
What's happening? Why can't I run away from that? Okay. Finally, I somehow got stuck in between the floors when I was trying to fall through. But I think we got him. Was a little rocky, but we pulled it off. Yes! Woo! But that could have killed me, especially if I did have survival at 19%. Something tells me it would have gotten destroyed if I didn't. But we did well, we did well, and I think in a one life challenge this also would have gone well. I just have to be a little more spendy with my healing potions. But otherwise I think I did well, and of course in a one life playthrough I wouldn't challenge this guy at level 11 with every pony. That's a, a given. But what does this show you, every pony, that we don't have to listen to any recommendations? Seriously, we just proved that because you need to be level 15 and we pinned him at 11. Was close. And I have to say, I'm getting better. I was able to use every single square of this top platform before I faced him in the side areas, which is harder. And I think I did that perfectly because, you know, there's nothing left. And I got him for, I think, almost three quarters of his health before he forced me out of the top area, which is good. Alright, now that we got that out of her system, let's head into the nuclear reactor. Unreal! Very hard. Unreal. Yeah, I'm not, not able to get in here. Also unreal. Yep. Oh my, sheesh, look at how fast that thing's radiating. We didn't even see that. Sheesh, game. Gotta give a pony a break, right? Hey, robots! Oh, maybe the, the, the other itty bitty robot that we just beat was the one that the raider struggled with. What about these robots? Eh. I got him. Take that! Short circuit! Ah! Guess your circuits are too short for that! Aha! Sorry. Short circuit. I, I think that means something along the lines of electricity things when you're giving them too much. Ah! I realize I have the wrong spells now. Um, equipment? I need the magical barrier. Alright! Joke's over. This show is mine now. And it is a show of destroyed robots. I like that. But every pony, I sort of think I'm getting good and ready for the one life challenge when that ever comes around. I mean, we're learning. It's rocky, but I expected it to be. And I mean, this is still the hard difficulty. And we didn't take a death there. So, you know, that, 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 gives, that makes me hopeful that we'll do fine when the actual thing comes around. Um, magic bullets. But I do wonder how very hard difficulty is gonna be to very hard. Come on, little guys, look at how slow they are! Because of this, the, the little things that I have. Oh, this is awesome. Alright, access terminal. Uh, fine, let's get the access terminal. But you don't immediately want to sometimes open them, because if you're opening these doors and unlocking them, you're also unlocking them from any, for any raider or robot that's that may be on the other side of that door. Well, oh, wrong spell, Leaf. Wrong spell. Huh? How did he shoot through that? What? All right, let's get you. Huh? Since when is this here? Um, since when is there a teleporting pony in this room? And with all the noise that we made, now she comes out. How's this pony worked? But we have a way out. Um, let's think about this. We need a right away. Get rid of the radiation. Gotta heal up all the way. All the way, every pony. All the way. Wizardry, I think, is important is a must at this point if I don't want to get roasted by this robot. Eh, might as well go all the way here. But I think we're fine otherwise. Oh wait, magical power is low. Magic potion? There we go. Put up that. I can't put up a... can't put up a shield somehow. Spell recharge! Huh? But I thought I had a wizardry potion. That felt awfully buggy, but I think that's something that's now in the game. Whenever you're taking a wizardry potion and you're suffering a cooldown from a spell, you're not removing the cooldown by taking that potion. You still have to wait that wait the cooldown of the old spell, every pony, right? I think that's what I'm getting out of this. So that is another thing to keep 
keep an eye out for in the One Life Challenge is when we're using wizardry potions to make sure that our cooldowns are actually all done, every pony. Alright, next we gotta get the soul turret. Gotta be careful about it. Let's just stealth him. Or crit him to death, which both works. Wait, I got an idea. What if I just go for this? Well, my character got hit a lot by that thing, though, huh? Let's go, go for the security terminal and just get all these turrets. Sheesh! That was wild and wacky. Almost too wild for me, and that's coming from me, Abby Pony. Oh, nice treasures. And this, and this. But you see, Abby Pony, it is not the bosses or the very hard difficulty you gotta watch out. It is for the little itty bitty bugs in the game that are not there. Those are what can kill you. The bosses can too, but only if you're not careful. The bugs will kill you without you knowing about it. Just something to keep in mind out, every pony. So we gotta go this way, into the stable door, to meet the second companion. And our newest dad robot, if I could aim. Sheesh! Character! What's wrong? Character, you're going crazy on me. Seriously? What the hell is happening? Is 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 it really that bad just because I got hit by on the hat a few times? You gotta be crazy! Is this a serious game? Can't be serious. Wait. I better return every pony and go back and heal myself up because this is not something that I want to stand with and for, because that's just gonna get me killed. Alright, we're back. Um, yeah, we were in here and we killed the first guy. Wait, his body's not there anymore. That's creepy. Alright, who's up for some, um, of this? And zap, and zap. Wait, what is the, those, wait. Am I addicted? I am addicted, every pony. That's a problem. That could also explain why it was a little easier for that robot to do so much damage to me. Huh? Oh, the Robo Owl. We need that. That is like the most important thing. The Robo Owl is big. And... Not much more, but we did get up. Wait. 511 pre-war bits is actually pretty dang good. Just like this grilled robot. <laughs> Every pony, I should not be overly confident with some of these enemies, though. The Quantum Cogitator. So, what does this do? Does it say somewhere what this does? It does. Increases lockpicking and terminal hacking by one. That's actually a need to have. That's very useful. And this way... Even more treasures, and this is... Hey, jeez, we, we're finding all the loot now, and like this. I guess that's what we get for having to go through all this nonsense earlier. Nice job, Leaf. Keep up the pressure and um, the magical work, every pony. But seriously, if you have enough magic, you can plow through everything, even giant metal tin cans. Installing new device. Huh? Contacts. 47... Category 35, primary addresses, search stable pie. Oh yeah, the one that we're looking for. The one that we had at the last terminal. Hello, little pip, it worked. Hush, do not shout, it. just woke up. Do you Forgive me, do I did not follow the time while I was breaking through the huge stable full of robots. Just listen, a group of ponies is operating here in Stable 88, who catch and enslave ponies. Which caught the chosen 24 sometimes ago and went looking for a stable. Wait a minute, if there's a threat to stable pie, we have to take strict measures. Okay, I eliminated them. Nevertheless, little Pip, I can't uh, blindly trust your words. I have the cogitator. Um, the two remaining, the Alicord amulet and the black book. So we're basically get getting all these things because someone told us to, but we gotta level up. Status skills. Um, yeah, without a question. Survival 5, telekinesis 5, except. Perks. Do we have enough for teleportation? We do. So we need level 12 for teleportation. That is a good important thing for next time 
When the one life challenge comes, teleportation against the robot is a must. It gives us a lot more mobility. And we won't be stuck on the sides that much. Alright, I hope that makes sense, are you pony? Equipment, potion of spirit. Um, yeah, that's really everything. Alright, let's turn back. Because we may also be getting a new spell now. Do, 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 do. Hey, Dusty Nebula. I can have the fireball. Oh, Celestia, I like this. But we are chewing through our bits, every pony. Seriously, I started this episode with 13,000. I'm down to less than half of that right now. Um. I don't think I want to do that for now. In fact, I'm actually getting another wizardry for this next section. And this time we're going to watch for our cooldowns, every pony, because that's a big one. Um. We're going to do what I did earlier. Let's take it su super seriously, like this would be a one life challenge. Buck, rage. We don't really need a dash. Or a medics. Eh, wait, medics is pain resistance, I forgot. I guess that we do need a medics. Um, next up we gotta go through here, right? No? So just go in here now? Yeah, we gotta go to Hanky Garages. Let's go to Hanky Garages. And just beat this next area. So this is another midway boss slash encounter. Hey there, Ant. Do you want to go on a barbecue with me? I don't think they want to, every pony. Um, Adam says they're good for a barbecue. Oh, I get it. Makes more sense, every pony. Oh, wait, really? I can't get that. It's better be worth it. Uh, who, who am I kidding, every pony? Ammo is never something that actually gets used by me. Inventory. We're just doing what I did earlier. Wizardry potion. Buck. Dash. Alright. Our potions are off cooldown. Or better said, our spells. Um, 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 um. Weapons. The lightning bolt. And I think I didn't give myself a med X. That's it. And go. So we just have to kill these. And I'm going to speed through the dialogue because you see my potions are ticking away as we speak. Essentially what they're telling us that we're supposed to surrender our Pip-Boy and if we don't they're going to attack us and we obviously don't. Up here. Whoa. Stay strong Leaf, stay strong. We're taking a little bit of damage but that's alright. That's alright. If this was one life challenge, we'd be doing pretty darn well. Arrgh! Stop jumping all the damn time, you need to actually get you killed. Ah! Short circuit! Ah! Got him. That wasn't too horrible. We handled that well, thanks to teleportation. Yeah, we definitely need to make sure we have teleportation before the robot in a one life challenge. That is a big, a big reminder when we, we, we hit, when we come back for one life. What do we do? Oh. So, am, am, what? Sciency talk. On the second glance, it, do, it doesn't. It lacks several uh, elements. The armament was removed. The infinite battery was replaced with a more compact and short term analog. Inside the case, there is a large cavity. No doubt, this is the Sprite Bot which was supposed to take the cogitator for me. Ah. So the meeting failed. Sprite Bot is destroyed, and whoever was going to take it does not have such an opportunity anymore. Oh, buck you nightmare moon freaks. At least the mentor gave explanations about two more missing things. And 25,000 more experience. Awesome. So how far am I in time, every pony? I don't remember, but the the robot one did drag out a little bit, but it was it was very exciting, every pony, and I think I think I definitely made a difference compared to, to the last few times I fought, so I guess I like the thought of getting better. New armor! Can I have this now? Of wait. There is a new armor. Police armor. Okay, let's take a look at this. So this seems to be sort of the mixed armor, everypony. Yeah. A little bit something against everything, but... Wait, 
There's no magic resistance on this. Oh, wait. Combat- oh, combat spells damage. That's this one. Protection against all this- Okay, I get it. This protects against certain types of spells, but I think the magic armor is gonna be better. Yeah. Let's go with, um... I don't know, you know what? Since I like trying new things, maybe the police armor is actually gonna be kinda nice. It doesn't have as much resistances against the magical elements, but bullets and blasts could actually be helpful. <sighs> but we'll think about it, every pony. It is your call. Do we pick the magic armor or police armor? You decide, every pony. But. Alright. So for these last few minutes, since we're approaching 30, I don't think I'll be able to beat a single floor of the new area within like 5 or 10 minutes. But we do have another area that I didn't get to finish last time. We did half of it last time, so we're doing the other half today. Here you are, a little bit. We kicked uh, Slaver's flanks, of course we did, and we blew up a giant tin can. I'll explain a little. Tal Talons are not ponies, they're griffins. Oh, griffins are nasty and they like money, every pony. That's basically everything you'd have to know about that, every pony. <laughs> 5,000 bits, what about this? Red Eye. Oh yeah, I remember that scene where... Uh, Calamity had an embarrassing moment embarrassing moment in the um, the fanfic when she was drunk and talking about Red Eye Every Pony, if you remember that. You will if you read the fanfic Every Pony, I'm pretty sure. Um, so we have to go to this. No, this place. We gotta go here. So last time we got all these saves, we didn't actually go underground though. And that's what I want to do now, is go underground, and sometimes you can get lucky with good treasures there. And it is an excellent opportunity to try our brand new spell. Wait, I just realized, what is the recommended level for Manhattan? <laughs> I'm certain it's not level um, 12. <laughs> oh, gosh. Well... I suppose I didn't do need to level at some point, but that means grinding, and grinding takes patience. I'm not the most patient pony. That's because I'm not a doctor. Haha! -ha. Get it? Because patience and doctors. Huh, I'm sorry, every pony. I had to do that though. Get rid of that. There's a can of paint and a hunting rifle. So. We did the two rooms that we just ran through the last time, and there actually is a way down, and this is where I want to go in now. Oh. Hey, hey there, little guys. Ah! You guys are persistent as heck, get out! I sat, get out. Have this. Drop that box. Yeah, nice caps. We gotta be careful, though. This is infested with ants and... There's even ant hives down here, if I remember anything. But I got myself on fire. That's the one thing you gotta be afraid of when using the spell. It's really easy to get yourself lit on fire. Alright. Hit that. Oh, Celestia! That guy blew up. No, he, he vaporized every pony. That's what that looked like. He just straight up vaporized into thin air. I got someone. Got that. And that, that, that. I don't know what I'm killing at this point, but but it was moving. Oh, it was a scorpion. Okay, we are rampant though, every pony. I guess that's kind of awesome. And sometimes you gotta go a little mad. Just don't go mad enough to the point where you'll incinerate yourself, and you'll be fine. I see something over there. Ah, got it. Hey, brat! No, we I mean, ant chief. There's so many things there that can get you. And zap. Zap. Oh, we need to heal ourselves, everybody. Taking a lot, a lot of damage down here. But I suppose in between episodes, I have to go through the factory a bunch of times because I did lose a huge amount of bits down here. And go! Got both of them. Oh, there's an ant hive. Let's get these. Zap! 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 
I got plenty of fire for all of you. See? Practice your magic and you'll be able to beat anything down here. Hello, Rat Scorpion. Do you have something? Yes. <sighs> An empty chest. Anyway, every pony. Now we gotta get back and I'm going this way. And we have a weapon thing. Oh, come on. So in other words, there was a whole bunch of junk over here and that's why I came out here. That feels... That feels glorious, every pony. What are you talking about? We do have a few things I need to sell today. Oh, wait. I didn't get to do any selling today now that I think about it. We should, we should make that a thing now. We did get plenty of stuff from inside the stable that may be able to alleviate our monetary issues. So much screaming in these empty halls. Almost gives it sort of a haunted vibe, every pony. So just use this to go back? Yep, you use this to go back. I'm pretty sure we don't have enough to buy one of those new armors, but I at least hope we can get back into five figure range, maybe? Oh, never mind! How do I have all this stuff now? Oh, in that case, I'm getting a new armor right now. Oh wait. We need to we need to not give away the the um the gems yet. We need those for the quest. How do I have so many bits? Um, okay, I won't question it, but... Still weird, so I guess I am kind of questioning it. And there we go. So, every pony, I still am not going to buy an armor right now, so... I want you ponies to decide which of these looks better on me, every pony, or... I, which one I should wear. But I suppose, every pony, with that... I thank all you lovely ponies so much for watching, and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye. And remember, every pony, if you have a machine that doesn't work, striking it with electricity a few times can work wonders, every pony. Also, if you want to see more videos like this, make sure to hit the subscribe button down below, and you'll be notified whenever there's a new video here, and there's new stuff for you every single day. And you don't want to miss it. Including battles against your local um, toasters and all that. Hmm.